Hey guys, welcome back to more My Hero Reactions. So last time we had that big fight between Deku and Todoroki. And as we figured, mm -hmm. Todoroki won. Mm -hmm. um, it, but not without using his fire. Yeah, not without using his fire. But the way they went about it was that the fact that Todoroki embraced it. Because you know, of Deku. Because Deku of Deku. Deku encouraged him to use his full power. Yeah, Deku wanted like make to... make it his own thing. Deku want, also wanted to fight Todoroki at his best. He didn't want to fight using... Having Todoroki use half of his abilities. Mm -hmm. You know? And that's what I really loved about the story last episode. Was that Todoroki finally, like, embraced it. Embraced his power. Embraced himself. Yeah. And not see this fire, the strength that he has and could potentially grow too as just being like limited because it's his dad's quirk you know like yes Endeavor is a fucking asshole he is but at the same time like we said it's his powers it's Todoroki's powers and and just do the best he can with it and I'm really excited to see the rest of this tournament we and... still have Bakugo in the match we still mm -hmm. have Tenya we Ida. still have the the rest of the supporting cast yeah <laughs> forgot much. their names um, yeah. So there's still more to come for this tournament. So with that being said, let's get on with this video. After you graduate, you'll work by my side. Nope. Nope. I'll lead you down the path of the mighty Shoto. Hell no. He'll do it his way. I haven't abandoned anything. Out there, for that one moment, I forgot all about you. <sighs> mm-hmm. Whether that's good or bad, maybe I don't need you. He doesn't. He doesn't. It's true that the match didn't go how we wanted it to. And realizing where you went wrong won't change that. But you helped a friend. Meddling where you don't technically have to. It's the essence of being a hero. Yeah, it's not just saving people. Yeah. He helped Todoroki, like, mentally. Yeah. It's not just saving them, like, physically from danger. Oh, Ooh. Tenya. Yeah. Let's go, Ida! Right? Let's go. Ida wins the match! Let's go, Flash! Does that mean Todoroki's gonna face Ida? I think so. In and round then three? Bakugo's gonna Bakugo's face... Bakugo's to Tokoyami? Yeah. You are about to say Takoyaki. Uh, yeah. And just so you know, I will not heal injuries like this anymore. Oh, shit. You must find a new way for him to use his power. There has to be an option that's not so self-destructive. She is not nice. gonna bail him out anymore. That just forces him to, you know... Think of a new strategy. Think of a new strategy, yeah. New Find a different way around this. Mm -hmm. Remember when you told me why you came to UA in the first place? To find a worthy successor to... Does he think he's not worthy? Yeah. One for all is a crystallization of power. If young Todoroki were to inherit it, the strength added to his own quirk would probably make him an unbeatable That would have been OP yeah. as fuck, dude. I was quirkless too as a kid. See? Did we did we figure that out? Yeah. Rare of a thing. I had someone who believed in my potential. His former teacher. My master mm -hmm. gave me one for all and raised me to become a hero. You never told me about that. It's not my fault you never asked. <laughs> surprising. Hey, are you there, Tensei? It's Tenya. I am currently on a mission. Tensei? His brother? Mm -hmm. We'll talk soon, brother. He looks so cool, dude. Head north. He does. Uh oh. What was that? His boosters are in his arms. He looks like Tenya. What the fuck? I found you. Well, they're similar. hero killer. Ooh. Are they twins? No. No, older brother. Older, yeah. Wasn't that that guy from the teaser? I think Season so. one teaser? Finale? Oh, this is who he's facing. Bakugo's gonna win. I'm up against Todoroki. Ooh. Well, Ida's gonna lose. Yeah. But that means you're overusing your quirk. And sooner or later, you'll fall apart. Yikes. That's what Bakugo was uh, planning. Talking planning and talking about before that quirks are there's limit there's their physical abilities so they have limits and he's pushing um this one to his limit 
It's been a good run, Ida. Yeah. But the golden voice to Roki. Gotta avoid both the ice and the flames now. Speed versus fire and ice. What's Ida gonna do? He can't push him out. Yeah. That's too easy for Todoroki. Ooh, Ooh, he missed! I have 10 seconds. I have to win this. Oh, shit! God damn, how did you not break his face? Ooh. Ooh. Gotta go fast! You gotta go fast! No, there's no way, dude. No. This engine, that's it. That's it. Ice, he froze down, I knew it. But it was too fast to avoid, even for me. I mean, what do you expect? I, I kind of low-key wanted Ida to win because of the speed. But, you know, it's Todoroki, man. Mm -hmm. He didn't even have to use his fire. Oh my god. Oh. Really after. Did he kill him? But you bastards are not heroes. Yikes. Uh oh. The only one with permission to kill me. All Might is worthy. Again, it's All Might. The villains are targeting All Might. I hope his brother's okay. That thing is so damn annoying. <laughs> He finds everything annoying. What else is new? Aw, oh, poor Shadow. Shadow's oh, crying, crying, dude. Bakugo's oh. winning this. Their Shadow's crying. Nope. Damn, Bakugo's fast. Right? He's been in the air. Well, that's it for Tokoyami. Did you know of my weakness before? I figured the fuck did he grab his beak? It was a pretty bad matchup for you. I almost feel bad. I surrender. Tokoyami gives up. There you go, the finals. Yeah, as we figured. Yep. It has to be next episode. Yeah. Because Todoroki versus Bakugo deserves a full episode. My money's on Todoroki. Same. I totally thought the bird would win for sure. The bird. I guess that means his quirk's not invincible after all. So no quirk is invincible. And all quirks have a limit. Mm -hmm. These finals have been one big showcase for Class 1A. Damn it. I mean, they're the stars. What right? the fuck do you expect? They're 1A for a reason. But Tenya, please listen carefully. It's your brother. Is he dead? A villain got Tensei. Is he dead? Ew. 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 It is the guy from the teaser. Season one. His eye thing looks like skin. Please remain calm. Oh, are they gonna oh. recruit him? Most likely. Because they all got a similar vengeance. They're all after all. Stain. Stain? Like a stain in your shirt? Guess, cause he leaves a stain when he kills you? I don't know. Okay. So, like we figured, it's gonna be Bakugo and Todoroki in the finals. Mm -hmm. um, I just really hope that Ida's older brother is okay. Yeah. It looks like Ida's gonna be taking a trip out to go see him. That guy, Stain, mm -hmm. is dubbed Hero Killer. Mm -hmm. So do you think the dub just kind of like made it seem like he's not dead, but he's really dead? Probably. What I'm thinking is in the sub, like, oh, your brother's dead. And then yeah. in the dub, because they kind of make it more family friendly, yeah. they made it like, oh, it's your brother. Like, yeah. dot, dot, dot. Yeah. You know? Because he's called Hero Killer. Why would he leave him alive? Yeah. I don't know, like, why would he, that's a good question, like, why would he leave his brother alive? Like, yeah, did he not go through with it, or did he, like, think he was dead? I don't know. Right? We just have to wait till next episode. But yeah, he has the same agenda as the League of Villains. Yeah, killing All Might. All Might. All Might's always their target. Yeah. Like, I know he's the number one hero, but damn, like, yeah. give the man a break, yo. Yeah. 
what is the history with all these villains and himself, you know? Right? Like, is it just because he's the number one hero? Is it because he spreads, like, happiness? <laughs> they hate that shit. Right? It, like, also, it seems like they hate the whole hero thing. Well, this one does. So does the... The, the one that touches you? You don't remember? I think I like, do. I think the, I do. The guy that touches you? Yeah, he also that... hates that whole... Yeah, like I remember it's him... It's a business. I remember him saying like... Uh, something like, Oh, if you guys do it, if heroes do it, then you're praised for it. But then when they do it... Yeah. It's like they get hated for it. Yeah. Something like that. Do it. When villains do it. Yeah. yeah. It's like the hypocrisy. So it's a similarity there. Mm -hmm. Like this one too feels like heroes just do it for the fame and fortune. Mm -hmm. So, and he's dubbed hero killer. So I just, you know, there's no telling what what happened to Ida's brother. Also, this episode kind of uh, dove into the aftermath of um, Deku's loss. Yeah. Like it's not over, you know. And I kind of yeah. figured he was gonna doubt himself. And thanks to All Might's speech, he kind of revealed that he, he was also quirkless mm -hmm. before, uh, before receiving, receiving One for all. all. Yeah. Also, so another thing. We kind of figured. Yeah, we kind of figured that. Yeah. Another thing to note is the fact that Recovery Girl said, Oh, yeah. Like, no more of no this. No more. No more. You got to find another avenue to use your quirk besides breaking your bones. Yeah. And I love how, like, she's telling him, like, your hand is gonna be a reminder of that. Like your crooked mm -hmm. hand is a reminder of like you can't break your bones. Yeah. You can't keep doing this. And as we figured, like you can't keep doing this. Yeah. Like you can only go so far and recovery girl can only do heal, so much. Do so much, you know? And yeah. the fact that this time around, like he had to have surgery. Mm-hmm. Like and, I would say that draws a line too. If I was a, for if I was recovery girl. From a story standpoint, like, you know, recovery girl's purpose has reached its limit i guess yeah because like you're just gonna keep going back to her it's gonna be repetitive exactly you know it's time to find a different like she'll way. heal him if yeah. it's like another type of like injury if it's minor i yeah. guess or like or i would just say like if it's another type as long as it's not like him destroying his body for his quirk and also i feel I like think, that's the lesson there it's, and i also i think that recovery is kind of like ultimatum to them will help Deku evolve into yeah. finding other ways to yeah. dealing with his quirk, mm -hmm. you know? And I love how she's like blaming All Might too, you know, like Deku's just a kid and he's just trying to like, you know, impress All Might, to be honest. And like, at the same time, it wasn't that the whole fight wasn't just for All Might, it wasn't for himself. Mm -hmm. He was helping Todoroki, to be yeah. honest. And that's heroic in its own way. Exactly. Exactly. And that's another thing to note. It's just the fact that like what All Might said is like that's the essence of being a hero. It's not just physically it's not just helping people. Saving people who are from in burning danger. buildings. Yeah. It's not like, just that, it's more than that. Yeah. And Deku really does have what it takes to be a true hero. Yeah. What these villains are saying that these other heroes aren't. Uh -huh. So, uh, you know, like... It's like, for me, Deku already has the uh, the other 50% covered of being a hero. Mm. It's basically what he's doing now. Yeah, like, like training. Yeah, no, like oh. helping, like how he helped Todoroki, like being a oh, hero in that way. Okay. Now he's just training to become a hero in like the traditional, you know, uh, mainstream from, way. The saving from burning yeah, buildings. Yeah, saving from burning buildings. Yeah, I like feel like he's training people. for that. And yeah. then the other 50%, he already has that covered. Yeah. You know? And then with the matches, we figured uh, Ida was going to lose to mm -hmm. Todoroki mm -hmm. because it's Todoroki. And then Bakugo is going to win against Tokoyami. Yeah. So I, I like how they just sped that up. Yeah. Because it's obvious the finals is going to be Bakugo and, and Todoroki. Todoroki. And so they leave that big fight for one for whole For one episode. episode, yeah. So I'm excited to see that because mm -hmm. I definitely want to see like what's going to happen because Todoroki has fire powers. Whether or not he's going to use that is the question, you know, because Deku kind of already got him to embrace himself in some sort of way. But does that mean that he's going to continue to do it? Yeah. Because he said to Endeavor, like what happened on the field was 
he forgot about his father, about that whole situation. Yeah. So whether or not he fully embraced it, mm-hmm. we don't know. And this- um, Bakugo is still pissed off at Todoroki for declaring war yeah. to uh, Deku and not him. Yeah. So I feel like he's gonna bring that up next episode. Probably. Like, Cause oh, it's like, this... oh, you declared war on yeah. the wrong person. Like, I'm here in the finals, not yeah. Deku. Yeah. Some shit like that. That sounds like something Bakugo would say. Anyways, what'd you guys think of this episode? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'm Danny. I'm Ray. And we'll see you guys in the next video.